Hello, welcome to Tech TV News Bites. My name is Sora Kumar, and today we are going to talk about the new Samsung Galaxy S4 LTE. This new variant has LTE advanced technology, thereby promising higher LTE speeds of up to 150 Mbps. It's known by the model number E330S. It looks exactly the same as the regular model of Galaxy S4. And talking about its specification, it differs in terms of chipset and internal storage. Rest of the specifications are the same. It has a Snapdragon 800 CPU and Adreno 330 GPU. The quad-core CPU is clocked at 2.3 GHz speed. It has the same battery of 2600 mAh though. So don't you think a powerful battery would have been more useful for a handset of this power? It has already been tested on Antutu and Quadrant benchmarks and indeed a Snapdragon 800 chipset is really impressive my friend. So let's take a look at the benchmark scores of the new Galaxy S4 model. Based on the reveal and 2 and benchmark test, we have a score of 29,976 for this model. Whereas S4 Octa scored 26,275 and S4 with a Snapdragon 600 scored 24,176. The difference between Octa and the HD800 model is of about 3,500 points here. That's impressive. Now looking at the quadrant benchmark test result, the difference has further widened. S4 Octa and HD600 model scores relatively close to each other, while HD800 based S4 beats them by scoring massive 18,581 points. The difference on quadrant benchmark test is huge compared to N32 benchmark. Now, let me remind you, there is our benchmark tests and results. The real-world performance may not be that noticeable as S4 Octa is already one of the most powerful smartphones. So if you ask me, do I feel any kind of remorse because I bought S4 Octa model? I'd say not. I'm happy with S4 Octa scores as well. Now, S4 LTE will start selling soon in South Korea while its release in other important markets is not confirmed yet. Thank you for watching this video. For more, don't forget to subscribe to us, do leave us your valuable comments.